Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am switching things up a little bit and moving from the vlogs into more of a fashion style video which I'm super excited about. For those of you guys who follow me on Instagram you know that street style and streetwear is my style and that's exactly what I'll be showing you guys today. A bunch of easy street style looks for you guys to style this summer. So I'll be showing you all of my favorite street style pieces right now and almost all of it will be able to be linked below, which is awesome. You guys know that I also love a lot of vintage t-shirts and vintage crewnecks, but I picked all of my vintage tees that actually can be linked, which is really awesome. So you guys will be able to shop basically everything like I mentioned. If you're new to my channel, you guys can follow me at Natalie Alyssa and I post a ton of street style outfit inspo like every day on there on my stories and on my feed, so make sure to follow me there. So, let's get into it. Okay, so we can just get started on the outfit that I'm actually wearing, and this t-shirt is probably one of my favorite street style finds of the summer, just because of the fit. It's super oversized and fits more like a t-shirt dress, which I love because it's so easy to style and just throw on for summer. And with this t-shirt, I usually just wear a pair of biker shorts underneath and I'll usually pair it with one of my ball caps like this. For me, this hat is an essential piece to my street style looks. Also with gold jewelry layered on top. I love to always wear my gold hoops and a gold necklace as well. And my crew socks are a must when I'm wearing my sneakers. You guys will probably notice that a lot of my outfits are with Air Force Ones in this video because they're just so easy to style and go with everything. They're also super affordable, so if you guys are looking to just expand your street style essentials, I definitely recommend getting a pair of Air Force Ones for your looks. Okay, so for this next look, I'm going to be styling this super cute baseball jersey, and I think this is actually one of the only pieces that I can't link specifically because I did thrift this piece but there are a ton of baseball jerseys like this out right now and I love the style of this. I usually just pair it with a little ribbed tank underneath and some bike shorts. You guys will catch me in a lot of sports inspired jerseys and t-shirts. Um, I feel like they are such a big part of streetwear for me personally and that's why I love this baseball jersey for summer. I've actually had this for a couple of years now. It's one of my like prized possessions from my thrifted finds. I love to style all of my streetwear looks with my gold jewelry. You will see that consistently across all of my outfits that I'm showing you guys today. I basically wear this necklace with like every outfit and these gold hoops, which I will have linked below as well. I feel like it just elevates the look, especially because streetwear is a little bit more comfortable and casual. Um, I find gold jewelry can really elevate the look easily. And of course, with this look as well, I will have my Air Force Ones. Um, you guys might get tired of me saying to pair these with your outfit, but honestly, they're just the go-to. I would also pair this look with a little bit of a shoulder bag, and I honestly wear this one all the time. You guys will see it in my Instagram post. I love to wear shoulder bags with all of my looks, and this one is really cute and affordable so I'll have it linked below of course. So overall super easy and comfortable and perfect for summer. That is the second look. Okay for this next look I am going to be styling this plaid button down and I know you're thinking how is that summer but on nights that are a little bit cooler this is something that I would easily throw on or even if I was going for a bike ride later in the evening. It does tend to get like a little bit cool. And this is like a staple for me. I wear this so much. I think I've had this one for a year now. I believe it's still linked on their website, so I will link it below for you guys. Since I already had the bike shorts and the ribbed tank out, this is something that I would easily throw on over top as well. With this outfit, I would definitely pair my new black and white dunks, just keeping with the black and white monochrome look. And with this look, I would also pair my New York Yankees hat with this as well. Super athleisure, elevated, and again, very easy and comfortable. A lot of you guys will probably have this look in your closet. Like, you could thrift this um, super easily. And just a basic white tank with your bike shorts 
and any ball cap that you have would make this look complete. This is like a very Hailey Bieber look. You would probably see her in a similar outfit like this and I love it. I am very much inspired by her looks because she does streetwear so well, well her and her stylist Maeve. I am always inspired by their looks. Super easy and super cute. Um, one of my favorite looks, to be honest. Okay, for my next look, I'm styling these sweat shorts. And sweat shorts are my staple for the summer. Other than a bike short, I love a sweat short because they're super comfortable and can easily be styled as streetwear. And these ones are really cute because they're a little bit more baggy and oversized, just how I like it. And with these, I would definitely pair them with a graphic t-shirt, which is, Something you guys will see me wearing like all the time. If I'm not wearing a graphic t-shirt, I'm probably wearing a graphic crew neck of some sort. I have an addiction to graphic tees. This one is one of my favorite new finds and I will be able to link it below for you guys. But paired with these sweat shorts, um, it's a super edgy and cool look. This would definitely be an outfit I would wear on just a normal day out in the city, grabbing coffee, walking around. This would be a go-to look for me for sure because it's super comfortable. Paired with my dunks and some crew socks, my gold jewelry. You guys are seeing a little bit of a pattern here. These little hints of jewelry, sneakers, accessories over top of your look instantly make something look more street style. So for sure, if you're looking for those little tips, I would say um, if you're trying to elevate a streetwear look, gold jewelry, some sneakers paired with like a graphic tee like this, you are instantly street style. Another tip is I always buy my t-shirts oversized. So for example, this one is a size large and I just love the way it fits. I like when my t-shirts are more oversized. I do feel like that's what makes something look a little bit more streetwear when something fits more baggy and loose. So you guys will find that Whenever you ask me about sizing for tops, usually I've sized up to a large or extra large even sometimes. So that's a little tip for this look. So my next outfit, I'm going to be styling these jean shorts. And again, this is probably the only other thing that I can't link. I actually DIY these myself. They were just an old pair of jeans from PacSun and I just cut them and added a little bit of frayed distressing on the bottom. Um, so I can't link these, but if you do have a pair of just three quarter length jean shorts, this look will be perfect. This is probably the other alternative to shorts that I would wear besides bike shorts and sweatpants shorts is more of a jean short like this. And with these, I would definitely pair it with a graphic tee, something simple like this. You guys are probably thinking like every outfit is with a graphic t-shirt, but to be honest, like that is all I wear and styled with different bottoms, like you can mix and match and that is how I usually put my looks together. But this is one of my favorite graphic tees recently and super affordable. Um, again, I think I got this one in a large. Um, yes, it is a large. With this look, I would switch up the sneakers though. I'd probably wear my Converse Run Star Hikes. I believe that's what they're called, but they are a platform Converse. And so I would pair that with this look for sure, as well as some big sunglasses. These are my favorite sunglasses. You guys can buy these on Amazon. Um, I used to carry these on Stargirl actually, and we just don't carry them anymore, but these cat eye sunglasses go with like every outfit and I love to throw them on. This would be another look that I would probably just wear in the daytime and you know, if I was just out and about doing my errands because it's super easy to throw on and just be comfortable. Okay, for this next look, I am going to feature the jeans. The jeans I literally get asked about every single day and they finally came back in stock, I hope. They're not out of stock again because they are a super popular style, but you guys ask me about these all the time. And even though it's summer, I still manage to wear these in the summertime because I just love them that much. But with this look, <laughs> you guys guessed it, I am going to pair a graphic t-shirt with this as well. Um, I think I might have a problem with my graphic tees, but to be honest, they are just everything to me. So I would definitely pair this tee with these jeans. I think I actually posted this outfit on my feed 
one week, maybe a few weeks ago, this exact look, and I love it. Especially this shirt, it's the perfect oversized fit, and I'm actually wearing a medium, so super oversized. And the back is really cool too, paired with these jeans, and I probably wear my Air Forces with this one just to keep it super casual. All right, so for my next look, I am going to be styling this bomber jacket. And this would be something I would wear if I was going out to dinner and needed to look a little bit more elevated. I would probably pair it with my favorite ripped tank and some bike shorts layered with some jewelry, your favorite bag, your favorite sneakers, crew socks. You're good to go for more of a casual dinner. This is something I would wear if it were to get a little bit chilly in the evening. And I love bomber jackets right now. I feel like they are super in style and very streetwear inspired. This jacket is a small, so it definitely fits oversized already. You don't really need to size up for these jackets, which is great. Yeah, this would be more of a look if I was going to grab drinks on a patio or that kind of thing and wanted to just elevate a little bit more but still be consistent to my style and stay comfortable. Okay guys, for this last look, I had to show you guys an outfit that features a pair of sweatpants because as you guys know, I love my sweatpants and even in the summertime, I still manage to put these on. Similar to my baggy jeans, this Aaliyah tee is probably one of my favorites. Perfectly paired with these sweatpants. It's instantly a streetwear look. Um, I would probably wear my dunks with this outfit just to bring in the black of the shirt and kind of make it a little bit more cohesive and for sure would then pair this trucker hat with this look with the green really cool I can't put this on to show you guys because I realized I have my hair in my slicked bun and it takes me forever to take my bun out and there's a ton of product in my hair so it couldn't even like come out if I wanted it to right now so it's fine but I would pair this hat with this look trucker hats are really in right now and this one was actually thrifted the only other piece in this video that I can't link there are a lot of trucker hats out there right now I've seen some on Amazon as well really cute and a great hat alternative to just like a sports ball cap like these this would be definitely a look as well I would wear just like in the evening if it was a little bit cooler and we were going for a walk and I just wanted to be comfortable. So definitely another really cute summer look. If you wanna style sweats in the summer, like me, I don't know, maybe that's not even normal, but I would definitely pair it with a graphic tee like this and a cute trucker hat. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed more of this fashion inspired video and make sure to subscribe as well so you don't miss the next video that I do. Also comment down below which look was your favorite. I would love to know. And if you guys are going to recreate any of these looks, I would love to know that as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you for the next video.